This is Chad Werner, founder of Optimize. In WordPress, there is a WordPress importer that lets you import content from another WordPress site into your current WordPress site. Uh, unfortunately, this importer has some issues, uh, especially with importing media. Um, so the file attachments, images, PDFs, etc., that you would have in your media library, um, it just does not work very well for importing those. A lot of times it just doesn't import them at all. That has been known since 2013. So fortunately, there is a WordPress importer Redux, which has been developed by HumanMade, and it's available on GitHub. Um, so there'll be a link in the blog post that goes along with this video. And if you scroll down the GitHub page, you will find WordPress importer Redux. You can download it as a zip. So you'll download that, and then in your WordPress site, you'll go to plugins, add new, upload a plugin, and you'll go and find that and install it and then activate it. All right, now when you go into Tools, Import, you'll have WordPress version two and that is this WordPress Importer Redux plugin. All right, so if we run the importer so step one is select your files. So you want to upload your WXR file. So this part is the same as the native WordPress importer. So you'll go and find your XML file and upload it. All right, then you'll start import. Now this is pretty cool. Um, it shows what you are importing, where it came from. You can assign authors if you would like now this is important, you want to check this box to download and import file attachments. What that does is um, the, the XML file that you uploaded does not include any of your attachments. It doesn't have images, PDFs, etc. So what this is going to do is as it creates your posts, pages, etc., um, it's going to go and grab those media items from the website um, that you're importing from. So then you start importing. And you can watch its progress as it goes through these various areas. Now, I'm importing into a site that already has this content, and so I'm getting failures because these things already exist, um, and so you can ignore that. The, uh, the process would run through on your own site. You can scroll down to see the progress as it goes if you're curious. Okay, I let that import complete uh, while off the video. And so now um, if it's finished, now one thing that I've noticed is that um, you often get backslash characters like this uh, inserted into your comments after you import through the WordPress Importer Redux plugin. But it's easy to fix. Um, all you need to do is install the Better Search Replace plugin. And I have already installed it and activated it. So then we'll go here to Tools, Better Search Replace. All right, and what you want to do here is search for backslash and then a single quote, or it kind of looks like an apostrophe. So backslash, single quote, and then you want to replace that with just the single quote, and that will remove that backslash character. And you want to do that in your comments table all right, and then if you want to, you can run this as a, a dry run first, so this won't make any changes. It will just show you what's happening. So I'm gonna just run that now. And so here it found 549 cells that need to be updated. Uh, and now I can run it again with unchecking this, and that will actually make changes to the database. Run search replace. All right, and that has made those changes. All right, and so now all of your content, including your media, your file attachments, should be imported properly.